1987, something remarkable happened at Forbes. Five years after introducing the now famous Forbes 400 list, a wealth team undertook the project that would set the stage for what was to become a staple in modern media. A short list of the most influential and prolific entrepreneurs from all over the world. This month, it is my honor to introduce to you another titan, Dr. Joseph Sian Ajabong, the executive chairman of Jospong Group of Companies. Dr. Joseph Sion Ajipong is responsible for the strategic vision of the Jospong Group of Companies, one of the most diversified holding companies in Ghana, with operations in other African countries and Asia. The company has business interests in approximately 12 sectors of the economy, with its biggest operations in waste management, ICT and banking, as well as automobile and equipment. It's going to be the seven, the six born of the 17 children of my father. Uh, my father's business got down, so we went to the village. He took us from the city to the village to stay there because nothing was moving. So I was schooling in the village, barefooted. Life was very difficult, very challenging. I saw the life of people there, very difficult, and uh, walking, moving around, no vehicle, nothing. Sleep in the dark, in the mad house. Sometimes uh, you have to go um, walk a distance of about 10, 20 kilometers before you move to the next place. Mm -hmm. So I saw the difficulty that people get through when you want to make life. So when I began from zero of starting a business, my passion and drive is that how to get some of these people out, create an environment where people and opportunity people can get opportunity for businesses mm -hmm. and people can make life easier. My advice to young people, those from the universities, those from the school, those unemployed, whether your father or your parents could not take care of you, I want to share this testimony to them and experience. I started from zero, from nothing. My mother was very ill and I have to take care of the family. So what I did was I started as a commissioner, uh, an agent. I go to uh, companies, take their products, and go to the street and sell and take a commission. So that is how I started my life. Though the concept is still the same, a lot has changed in the last couple of years. Aside the evolution of our valuation methods, there's been a large shift in people of African descent being celebrated for the remarkable feats in business, often overcoming even more remarkable odds. Dr. Joseph Sion Ajipong embodies this ethos. Have an enjoyable read. <laughs>